Hey guys, and welcome back. I know it's been a while since I've posted, but I do hope that you've all been well. Um, today, I am back from break. Well, I've been back from break for about a week, but I was getting settled back in school, and uh, I was home for the holidays, and I didn't really have time to dedicate to the channel. But I'm back now, and I wanted to get started on a new series on EU4. Now, um, this won't be in Iberia, which is what the newest patch focuses on, but there is some fun mechanics such as the um, the flagships and stuff that I really do want to mess around with. And I want to play as Holland. Now Holland starts as a uh, vassal of Burgundy. But you have some pretty good ideas. Dutch ideas are pretty decent for trade. Um, if you can't tell because the Dutch are historically a trading nation. So sailors and force limit is really good. And then their ambition is trade efficiency. They get a free merchant plus a trade range. I'm not sure if that's necessary, necessarily very, very helpful, but um, dev cost is going to be super nice. Naval leader fire two. Okay. Siege tolerance of heretics. Land fire. Yeah. I think we're going to do this. And I have a few mods installed, but I'm not. Um, if I remember, I will list them out, but they shouldn't, it's not too bad. So, uh, let's go with Holland. And the goal of the playthrough is to form the Dutch nation. And we'll see where we go from there. But my main goal is just to form the Dutch nation and possibly the all your trade are belong to us achievement. Uh, but that will be decided at some point in the future. For now, I just want to get started, get playing. I was home for break and I was listening to the, um, the, what's it called? The soundtrack of EU4 on my, in my car. That's how much I miss this game. Okay. So let's see our startup here where we got a five, 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 which is good. And he's only 48. So he might be around for a while. Cheap advisors and stab cost. Okay. We are a duchy, I believe. Yes. Okay, cool. Um, so, I'm not entirely sure. Yeah, this is all the same. So the Dutch don't get any special thing until we get our... Um, our special... Until we get the Netherlands. So, and then we'll get our... What's it called? Uh... It's called, like, the Dutch Republic. It's a, it's a unique... It's a unique um, government type. So Admin Tech 10 is independent. Okay, so what all do we need? Oh. Oh, that's super easy. Okay. Yeah, we can definitely do that. Okay. So that's not anything I'm too concerned about. So first of all, let's turn off the army. Uh, we do have a capital fort. Or do we? Yeah, we do. We have a capital fort. Nice. Oh, we have a, a castle on our fort. Um, so, first of all, who is willing to support our independence? Not France. So, who are you rival to? England, Denmark, and Venice. So, England's about to get their booties kicked by France, though. So, that's not going to be too helpful. So, actually, let's come in here. And I'm not necessarily going to do this right away. I want to mostly just see. So it's just Venice and England. Hmm. Maybe if I get them both right off the bat and I declare it right away, they'll join me and England will be able to come over and do take care of some stuff before France attacks them. And if not, we can just redo it. It's not a... It really doesn't matter to me. So in that case, actually, let's not turn this stuff off. We might go into some debt right off the bat, but... Um, so let's build up to our force limit. What do we got here? Just one cav. That's fine. And we might actually need to go over, but for now, we're not going to. And... Yeah, that's fine. So... They have two heavies. Oh my goodness. Okay. Well, in that case, we're just going to keep our... Um, keep the fleet hidden. Do we have any leaders? No, we do not. And do we have any special advisors? Not you? No. No, okay. So it's a pretty generic start. That's fine. 
So when we start this war, we're going to be against... Yeah. Burgundy, Brabant. Okay, and who else is, are they allied to? I don't know. So we need to wait a couple of days to get our advisors back. So they're allied to Friesland. Hmm. Okay, well let's let this first month play out and see what we're working with. Okay, Shadow Kingdom. See, I am very scared. Actually, hold on a second. Let's see here. Will you let me... What? No military access. Bruh. Okay. Well, I was gonna say I can try to, um... Take my... My soldiers and b ship them off to England, but... Apparently not. Oh, they need a Jagellion? Cool. Build up to the force limit. I will take that. A little bit of extra... Uh, morale would be good. Uh, nope. I did not mean to hit that. Okay, so... I feel like between this, we should be fine. Is there nobody else who's willing to support me? No. Hmm. Okay. Well, let's just get these guys up here then. And actually... So, I guess we should mess with our estates first. Um... Holland can go to the burgers. There we go. Diplo. Um... Zealand is already in the nobility, so can't do anything about that. Okay, we'll just take our 50 then. So, you come in here, you come over here. Alright, and so my goal is to declare the war. Personal England... Our personal union is with Burgundy is dissolved. Okay. Now let's see if England wants to, um... Oh, shit. I should have, um... Okay, I didn't lose anybody, so that's good. I should have used my... Um... Shit. Okay, I made a mistake! <laughs> Will I make it? Let's see here. Alright, first of all, let's boost you up, and then we're going to need to take out a couple of loans. Boost the war taxes. And then a couple of... ...these boys here. Alright, when are you coming? The 12th? Yeah, there's no chance. Maybe... Yep. Okay, that's fine. Oh! England decided they, uh, they wanted to spot me, so that's nice. Cool. Come on now, let me go. Thank you. And am I still? Oh, okay. So my force limit raised when I when I abandoned the, uh, the union. Cool. So let's get you over here. Over here. Get a repair tick. Okay. Nope. I want you. Did I bring an admiral? I did not. Okay. Well, that's a weak sauce admiral, but that's fine. We'll take it. So right now we're just trying to flee until we can, um... Okay, so Surrender of Maine... I don't know if it actually can fire with it occupied by Burgundy. It's an interesting concept. So right now it looks okay. We have a lot more forces than them. It's just a matter of, are they going to send them? Because this guy, he's going to come over and get stack wiped. I would like it if England would, uh, would do something to help. Okay, do we have... We do not have military access anywhere here. So, unless I'm crossing the strait, I'm not going to be able to do anything. Okay. Hmm... Might as well get some more score from blockading them.
My legitimacy is abysmal. Still making a profit somehow, so that's nice. So all I need to do is get a white piece and I'm good to go. Holland will remain a subject. So how do I... Holland will remain a subject. So how does this work? I'm not a subject. Oh, grant independence. Damn. Okay. My bad. I was looking right at it. So England is literally doing nothing. Oh, wait, no, he's got some guys down here. Okay, so they might... Ooh. Okay, so he'll... they're on my capital, but they're going to be taking some pretty good attrition there. 2%? Okay, it's like... Hmm. All right, well, let's see what we're working with here, actually. Because I'm pretty much just banking on England and uh, Venice to do all the work for me. So England has a lot. I have a decent amount, actually, compared to Burgundy. They're low on ma manpower. They already have mercs. Okay. So he's definitely taking a lot of attrition. Somebody's fighting. Okay, no, it's all attrition so far. So if Venice takes... Mm. Okay. Oh, they stack wiped him. Oh, geez. He's in trouble. And England's down here. Yep. <laughs> no luck on that one. Hmm. So far, so good. Because I'm getting a ticking ore score. Equal losses. Oh, they just gave main. Oh, that's nice. That's really good for me. They just gave main away. Okay. So, let's see here. Just 1% attrition. Hmm. Burgundy is definitely losing manpower. And once they do, they're going to start murking up. And when they start having uh, problems with money, that's when they're going to really, really start um, hemorrhaging. Okay. So, I wonder if I can get any... Any um, personal unions lined up. Nassau... Van Keppel? Is that me? It is me. Okay. Who else? Let's see here. On halt. Perfect. There we go. And then if we can get either of these guys... Oh, Sax Saxony? No, I don't want Sax to fight Saxony. Damn. Feels bad, man. Nassau's me, though, right? Yeah. Alright, cool. Um, So England is getting... They're getting there. Burgundy's getting a lot of war exhaustion, and I somehow have none, even though they're sieging me down. Oh, look at that. As I look at it, they get a wall breach. Feels bad. They've lost a lot of men, though. Um, 144. Um, he's only 19. I'm all right with just getting some people influence. No big, no big deal. Speaking of that... I can't get any. Okay. All right. So I'd really like to see at least one or two of their forts go down. Is that a status quo? Nice. Oh, man. I'm nervous about this wall breach. So if we can... Oh, they got a wall breach here. They're finally positive here. Yeah, if, if we can get our independence right off the bat, then we'll be good to go. I don't know if I should be keeping that... Uh, that stuff going, the war taxes, but I kind of don't want to take out any more loans than I need to. So we are actually getting kind of close. They'll take my capital and we'll lose our ticking war score. Okay, we got an innate, or what's that called? Nevers, whatever. Nivernay or... 
I'm not going to pronounce any of the French stuff right, so... I apologize in advance. So we're at 10. Uh, I hope they t take something before their capital. A. Still not enough. Feels bad. Look at that. So close, too. Status quo. They're on their capital. Oh my goodness. Look at this. Oh. Oh. <gasps> and we're free! Just like that! Alright, cool. Well, that was easy. I probably could have done a little bit more, but I'm not gonna push my luck. Alright, let's get all these clowns out of here. On halt, and all them can ally up with me. Nassau doesn't want it. Oh, they got a... They got an heir anyways. Okay, Saxony and Holland. Cool! So, let's get these guys out of there. Oh wait. Er, boom. And then is my force limit 10? Cool. Okay, so... I guess I should uh, kind of focus on paying off my loans for now. Uh, let's get some spy network set up. Uh, I guess we don't really need to worry about this for now. So we should probably try to get on Austria's good side as well. Maybe even ally him. That would be ideal. <laughs> Excuse me. Hmm. Oh! Okay, and as soon as we bring these guys over... I need, actually, I can just do that right now. Just split these guys off with the leader. Protecting trade in the English Channel. We're transferring there and there. That's, that's what we want. Yep. Alright, so let's see how much that actually brings our trade up. 266. Should bring it up over 3, I'm hoping. What? Okay, so it was already adjusted? Oh, it's repairing. Okay, so 264. And then the next ticket should go out. 265 up to... Yeah, definitely a little boost. I like that. France is the papal controller. So, hmm. He's not he's not rival Burgundy. Okay. These guys are getting whooped by the auto derps. As long as we can keep our ally in UK, I think that's going to be the big one for us. What do we want first? I suppose we should have no focus. I will definitely marry you, England. If I die, I bet somebody from Lancaster. Yeah. On halt. Man, I don't know. Who's... I could... Mm. Yeah, I don't think I'd be able to fight that war because it would have to be me against all of them, right? I don't think I can call my allies into a succession war. So my Duke's okay. He's not horrible, but he's not good. Um... Oh wow, this is... These are both pretty bad. Um... So... I think we're gonna go with, um... With the noble regiments. Just cause I really can't be bothered to fight them. We have the money, so let's just top off our... Force limit and we'll just defend. So... Hopefully, get that soon. Okay, and then one more tick. There we go. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Whew, sheesh. Alright, that was a little bit, uh... A little bit... More deadly than I feel like it should have been. But that's fine. Unrest in Zealand? Why is that? Oh, disloyal clergy? Or nobility? Not much I can do. So is this my leader? It is. It's pretty good. I don't think I can afford that, can I? It probably would be best for us to drill our armies early like this. Get work that professionalism up while we have the, the low force limit. I think we can handle it. We have a, a good amount of uh, monarch points coming in. So, 
let's claim Friesland. And let's claim Utrecht. Trade power. Yeah, I don't want to give you trade power, so. That's a, a no from me. A solid no. All right, so then when we get 25, we'll be able to claim. Actually, does this have adjacency? Is this connected? Let's find out. Oh, I think it does. Okay. Dun, 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 dun. We're getting close to teching up as well. Who are you allied to? Scotland, Burgundy. Okay, yeah, no chance. Am I the first one to get Miltech? I am. Was I first to get both of them? No, just one. Okay, let's see. Who, Utrecht, who are you allied to? What does England want? <laughs> I don't know about all that. <laughs> I mean... I can probably offer you, like, some of Brittany's land. Nothing over here, though. This is all mine. Um, and we've worked up a whole 1.2 professionalism. Okay, we'll give it a shot. How much debt am I in? We're doing okay. We're definitely doing okay. So, let's wait a couple of ticks. And we can declare. He's got his army over here. He's not at war, so we're doing okay. I already have three... Favors with him. Okay. I feel like that's pretty quick. So, we want to jump on him before he hits mill 4. One more tick. Okay. Brittany, Frankfurt, Mecklenburg. Okay. Put our shock leader in charge. Maybe a stack wipe? Nice. Perfect. Alright, so... How much... Where's all their army? Brittany's got a lot. Okay. So let's get a blockade there. And let's just cut what we need out. Oh, no. Okay. Wait. Oh, it's level three? Holy hell. All right, that's gonna, that's gonna cost me a lot. Hmm. Okay. I think England just raised a bunch of troops. But, uh, yeah, we're doing okay so far. I have a claim on both of these, so if I can grow, that would be ideal. To be honest, I should keep my, uh, my sp spy network growing there, and I'm gonna put one over here as well. Help with siege ability. 28-day siege ticks is not bad. Though I need to really make sure that I'm able to, uh... I really need to make sure that I can get this siege. This is very important. Oh, I claimed this one too. I didn't even look. Overstaged. Or however it's pronounced. We're making progress. England is sieging down Brittany really soon. So I'm going to give him some of Brittany's territory in the peace. Okay, they're taking Calais, which is good for me. The longer I can just stand over here and take attrition, the better. Because once I take Utrecht, like... There's, there's no big deal. I can go and I can probably just stand on Frankfurt and they'll peace out. The Renaissance, where is it? Yep, Milan. Oh, it's in Venice, actually. Oh, they'll probably give me, uh... They'll probably give me, um... What's it called? Share technology or whatever. Okay, we're definitely making progress. 
This one's close to going Finistre or Finistere or whatever, and then Nantes or however it's pronounced. Oh, nice. Okay, can we get a stack wipe here real quick? Nice. Let's just take this. We're doing so good, and they have low war score compared to us as well. Mecklenburg has, oh, Wilhelm, or Willem, 534, that's pretty good. Okay, 6332. Uh, fuck off, all right. I suppose maybe we should try to siege down Rostock. It's only a level two, level one fort, so. Oh, they got Black Flag? How does that work? Oh. I didn't even look at that. I should have been a little more careful about that. So let's get these guys back protecting, protecting trade. I don't know why Mecklenburg was Black Flag, but it was. Alright, so let's come over here and siege them down, see if we can piece them out. Um... If I can get some money from them- Oh! I didn't even see them. Well, <laughs> don't need to see them anymore because they're dead. Easy stack wipe. I'm playing this game on easy mode, I swear. What's that war score for me? Oh, they're catching up. That's fine. So, I definitely want money from you. Oh, vassal, huh? That would be a lot of aggressive expansion. Yeah, I can't do that. I could have them... I might be able to just try to get use them for prestige. That might be what I have to do. Yep, okay. This war is pretty much a wrap. Let's see how much it's gonna cost me for this. 37? That's not bad. I can live with that. Plus one of them's gonna get... Um, one of them is going to get nabbed for, uh, what's it called? Unlawful territory. So I need to be careful about that. And I'm also looting here. Okay, we're getting some loot. Okay. Mm. I won't do war taxes because I want to keep up on Miltech best I can. So now we just need to siege down Rostock. They're still getting Calais siege down. A disputed succession, Aragon, huh? Castile and Aragon, both? Neither of them want any, want a marriage with me. Lundberg, Aragon, and Serbia. Württemberg. Oh, that's Württemberg. Doesn't want it. Lundberg does want it. Can I afford it? I can't. How old is he? 34. All right, well, we'll wait on that. If he gets it older, Say he hits like 50, then we'll do it. Because that's kind of the critical age where they'll start dropping like flies. That a baby, I like that. All right. Frankfurt is still high enthusiasm. So as soon as the UK goes over and starts sieging Frankfurt, we'll be a lot better off. Make sure we keep playing off these loans. Oh, we're done. Nice. So this, what? 27 ships? Okay. Between the two of them, they have a lot of ships. Six galleys from Mecklenburg. Alright, cool. So, let's let that tick go by for the month. Cool. Bring you back. Let's piece you out for all of your money. War reps and steer trade? No. I think I should probably get some uh, prestige. Uh... Hamburg, I don't really care about either of these. Nice. Okay. And then... Let's see if we can... Peace out this. Twenty-seven favors. I can live with that. You know, I don't really want to make Britain strong, but I can't say that these are good provinces. And they're both farmland, but... Maybe I give them this one.
How many favors is that? 24 still. He doesn't want the... Okay, so he just wants these two. Um, do want more money though. About armor and... How much will I get of this? 27? I guess that doesn't matter as much. How... I'm trying to get one that I can get a decent amount of money as well. Doesn't look like I'm getting much money regardless. Okay, that's fine. So... Cool. We got some serious... And then... Will you, uh, no, damn, feels bad. Yeah, he's gonna ask for um, unlawful territory and I, there's nothing I can do about it. I just have to sit on the province. So let's actually come to Helra, wait for it and see. And if it's on this overstaged or whatever, then I won't, um, ooh, level two trader for half price. Wait, oh, I made a mistake, feels bad. Shit, I just paid like 15 gold for that. Ah! Shaisa. Alright, which one is it? Utrecht? Nah. You good, fam. That's fine, though, because I'll just sit on it. Twenty-four percent unrest. That's nuts. So when that blows, will it be both provinces? Mm-hmm. Okay, that might be a problem. All right, I should... I should probably see if I can get uh, Helra to give me this province sooner or later. That way I can connect my lands. But I think that'll probably do it for the first episode. I'm not entirely sure how I want to do this um, episode setup. This one's been a long one. It's already been 30 minutes, but I'm thinking 30 minute episodes might be what I stick with because I've been watching, I think it's Zlevik is how it's pronounced, a Polish guy, YouTuber. Uh, I'll link him down. He's great. I love him. He's got a series on Granada right now that I'm, I'm loving every episode. He did a episode on Brandenburg into Prussia, into Germany, into revolutionary Germany, into an almost world conquest, and I watched every episode, so he's the one who really got me hooked on EU4. Like, I love the game, I have a thousand hours in it, but he, uh, he's great, so make sure you check him out. It's, uh, Z-L-E-W-I-K-K, -K, I think, Zlevik. Um, but anyways, yeah, that'll do it for this episode, and, I uh, hope to see you guys next, next time. I hope you enjoyed the episode. And uh, yeah, this is Chewy Shoot. I'll catch you guys later.